Hey everyone, I'm Turbo 64 here, and today, this is it. I mean, this is, obviously isn't it because we still got a lot more to do, but in terms of just the trophies alone, this is it. This is it. It seems that I did not give you enough credit, yes? I won't make that mistake again. You savages will learn fear. Just as millions have before you. <laughs> this AI. His AI can be a bit unfair if you don't pick up on the patterns. And even then it's a little bit unfair. It's basically the whiz pig of this game. You know, the good whiz pig, not the, uh, that one remake. This is it. Enjoy your leave. You won't have it for long. Oh, he'll make sure of that. Oh, did I hit him? It hit him! Yo! Finally, some competition. Uh oh. You do not want to get all up on him like I am right now, because uh, he starts firing missiles at you. He'll start shooting basically everything he got on you. Same with here, over here. He's gonna throw a bomb at me. If I don't get out of the way. Ah! Okay, so there is an area I can just cut off right here. Oh, well, can't make that. <laughs> I can't believe I had him with that first bomb though. That was actually an achievement. Basically, when you get to V though, make sure you stay away from him when you're when you either get close to him or when you actually are ahead of him. Cause he uh, he'll have missiles shooting at you. Huh? Just cut through shield? Yeah, if I get hit twice, I'm gonna end it. Uh, this is such a difficult boss. At least with him and his minions. His minions don't make it any easier. I jumped over it! Why? Basically, you want the Wumpa Fruit. There's no and ifs or buts about it. You want this thing. Uh oh. Ah! What the? It's still going? Alright. Okay. Now I'm in a lead. But that won't mean much since I don't have all 10 Wumpa Fruit. And he's right there. Go, 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 go. Hurry up so he's not... So the missile doesn't aim at you. Alright, I'm right here. Let's go. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. By the way, as you probably are able to tell, I don't have the map anymore because of the stage. Here, all I have is a speedometer, so... All I can check is how fast I'm going, and I'm gonna need it so I can stay away from Velo. Well, the speed boost cans, I, as you can see, I have. Alright. I don't want to call this a solid lead just yet. Don't jump over this. Okay, now let's go. I still see him in a very distance, so all I gotta do is just drive optimally. And I should be set. So hit nothing, touch nothing, get hit by nothing, no missiles, nothing. And keep taking that shortcut. Do I see him? No, I don't see him anymore. I think I just saw his minion. Which is a good thing because I want to make sure they're the ones I'm worried of, more worried about than Beetle himself. 
Oh, and don't you even dare think about falling. Like, this is a boss I can actually worry about, like, strategically about laying out my items for traps and stuff like that. This is that boss that makes me think. Simply going fast won't make you win the waste. The waste? Let's go with it, because I'm in, I'm like in a good lead, not a solid lead. A good waste with this anyway. Okay. Crash put it best when he says that. I said Crash. Can you imagine if Crash actually said something like that? It'd be pretty. It'd be pretty interesting. And honestly, the time relic for this stage is also would be also interesting. I'll discuss the relics when we get there. But as of now, this is pretty much. Now I'm going to start calling it, it's in the bag. With the nitros in perfect position, these traps are starting to disappear now. It's all good. We're in the clear. The most you would have to do in order to win is by, like, getting completely out of nowhere. And just be like, oh, I'm sorry, I was right here this whole time. I don't even hear him anymore now, because we're in completely different dimensions. <sighs> kinda close, kinda close, but we're still in the lead. And that's what that, and that's what matters. Okay, I still don't see him. And I got three more boosts. I'm calling it. This is it. This is it, pretty much. If I got three boosts, and I'm this far ahead of him, and are juiced up versions of it too, this is it. We're done. It took only a few tries, but still took less than 10 minutes to do. That's it. That's this. That's basically this part of the video. By the way, you unlock certain parts of cutscenes that you don't get, like. If I finish on the- I beat him without showing the other cutscene, so I'm gonna get that cutscene as well. It's better you see it. Congratulations. You have won the Galaxy Circuits. And you put on quite a show. Am I right, everyone? You are now free to go. Great! Send us home! What? You mean Earth? But now I have to destroy Earth. Since you no longer want to race, you can't go back there. I thought I was pretty clear about that. That's not fair! What do you mean? You're free to go. We're not going anywhere. We'll keep racing if that's what it takes. A rematch? How exciting. But there are rules to follow. You first need to earn all my time relics. Then we can race for the fate of your Earth. The one is the one we just saw. The second one is the one if Vila wins, like if you just see the whole cutscene. And the third one is if we retry. Which of course we're gonna do. I'm gonna open that one later. I wanna hold off on showing it period, but I'd hate it if I did it too, so. Here's Velo's fall. This is important simply because of uh, what we're gonna do. You see this? You see those things? Actually, it's best that uh, Aku explains it. To compete in a gem cup, you must have enough tokens of the same color. 
and there's basically red, blue, green, red, blue, green, and purple. Or is that pink? Oh, whatever color it is. We also have this. You do not have enough relics to race on this track. What he means by relics is basically once you get like the relics from you need all the relics and you need the gems in order to do that one race. That one. Alright, so let's go back into Terra. Alright. So the hell begins. In this part, in the next part, we will do both the CNK challenges and the relics. Obviously, I'm talking about that. Obviously, we're going to do that other, like, crystal challenge in the other part over there. But yeah, this is where the insanity begins, folks. This is where the platinum strikes back.